Hi guys, this is Winifred and welcome to Wild Card Wednesday on a Thursday. Um, as promised, I am going to give you a quick tour of my bedroom. And I am standing outside in the hallway. This is the view that you would get. Now this is my second time shooting this because I'm shooting on my Nikon and of course <laughs> the sound got jumbled up again. So I'm just going to walk in. Well actually what I should have shown you was the um, ceiling light first. But this is from the other side of the room looking at my bed. And if you notice the... Um, Furniture is kind of Asian in influence. Um, it's cherry wood with brass accents. And if you look at the legs, you kind of see the Asian influence of it. And I have a beautiful Asian influence lamp on top of it. And I got these lights, guys, the lamps, my bedside lamps, by chance. I was in the same place that I got the ceiling light from and I happened to turn around and I saw these lamps and I'm like, I'm not sure if it's going to match, but I'm going to make it match. <laughs> so I picked these up with the hopes that it would match and lo and behold it did. And main of the main reason why it matched is because of this picture. This picture has a lot of browns. Um, some blues, some tans, some silvers, some grays. So it kind of picked up the color on the lamp and the lampshade as well because the lampshade is kind of tannish color, linen color, which kind of picks up those colors in the uh, picture as well. And I like these kind of pictures in the bedroom, guys, because it's soft. No soft, no hard edges, so... It kind of lulls you to sleep, you know, it's not jarring to the eye. These pillows, guys, are old. I got them in 2008. I got them from Z Gallery. But lo and behold, when you buy things that blend with other things and buy things that you really love, you can usually make them work. So, of course, the back pillow is the pillow sham. This pillow, this pillow, and then the front sparkly pillow which is not picking up because of the lighting I got all of these from Z Gallery the dark brown one is a silk pillow well all of them are silk, silk pillows and I just love them and yeah I picked those up from Z Gallery and that's the other nightstand with the matching lamp on there and the bedding guys came from Kohl's it doesn't fit they didn't have a double size uh, uh, bed set so I bought the queen size it's like oh well make it work now my side my corner of the house is has one color in common and that color is brown I think that just creates unity if you recall my makeup room is brown and green this room is silver brown and uh, blue and the bathroom is coppery, brown, and tan. So it kind of creates like a cohesive setting to me. Now, there's the, the dresser. You can kind of see the oriental influence. It's a tri-mirror dresser there. I had my um, contractor, Ruben, extraordinaire, mount the television to the wall because I didn't want another piece of furniture in here and I surely don't want to see all those cords hanging. So my cable box and my Blu-ray is sitting above the cable box. All of that's mounted to the wall out of the way. This wall that we're looking at guys, I don't know if you can tell, but it is a metallic gray and it's a Martha Stewart color. And um, yeah, it's my accent wall, if you will. You might recognize these two chairs. They came from Pier 1. They were blue. They're blue with brown legs, so I knew that they would match the 
draperies are brown with uh, silver, blue, and brown squiggly lines going through them. So that all ties in. This is my jewelry chest, guys. It does not match the bedroom. Well, wait a minute. It didn't come. It's not part of the bedroom set, but it blends because it's like that cherry wood color. This is where I house all of my jewelry, guys. These, this top drawer here, um, most of my rings are in here. Um, this second drawer here, I keep most, all of my earrings. Then this drawer, I've really got to start wearing more of these items, guys. These are like my cuffs that, you know, I haven't worn. This is a lowest heel one. Really nice. I need to clean up these cuffs and actually start wearing them. Um, I have two closets in my bedroom. This is my chest of drawers, guys. And on this side, I keep mainly all of my purses, clutches, yada, yada, yada. Excuse the mess. It's not organized, as you can see. Um, and on top here, I love this lamp. It's more or less an accent lamp. It's not a purposeful lamp like one that you could read by. But it's called an urchin lamp because of the texture. This also came from Z Gallery. Can you tell I love Z Gallery? <laughs> so this, usually when I have company, I have this light on and the other light on um, across the room. And um, yeah, so that sits on top of my chest of drawers. I didn't talk about this table, guys. This table, I love this table it is a it's called a Cheyenne horn table and it let me see if I can bring it in a little bit closer if you notice the legs are made of actual horns and the top has that beautiful horn like texture that also came from Z Gallery and if you look at the lamp on top of it, I got this from uh, House of Lights in Lyndhurst. It's down the street from um, Cleveland Lights, uh, where I got my, my picture from, my ceiling light, and my uh, nightstand lights from. But this I bought just simply because of the... I mean, I love it. I love the fact that... Look at that shade, number one. And then the bottom just mimics the shade. So I love that. And I don't believe I showed you guys, but this is from my ceiling light. And I got this from uh, Cleveland Light. And that's again in Lyndhurst. I love this light because, guys, if you look at the globe, it looks like a flower. It looks like maybe a peony, maybe. It's on cables, it's suspended. It can either be a hanging light or a ceiling light. And so for the bedroom, of course, a ceiling light is more appropriate. So it too has a, a kind of a cream globe and brown and the globe sits in the brown setting and then there's cables I want to say there's like six cables on uh, around the uh, globe and those are silver they can be lowered now the so it, yeah I've got that my ceiling is painted over white is an accent metallic wall here that is to the wall uh, silver like a uh, <laughs> bluish and the rest also are kind of which I love gray with I'm going to give you one more look so, around the room. I'm going to walk through. I don't think I left anything out, guys. If I did, if you have any questions, you know, comment below. I'll be happy to answer. Um, it looks a little plain over here. I want one more picture right here, guys. I just haven't been able to find the picture that I want. And then I want another picture right here. 
I'm just looking for something that's nice and soft and blends with the room. In keeping with my calming theme of my room. And um, yeah, guys, this is it. One more pan around the room. And this concludes my first floor tour of my home. And I thank you for watching. And you all have a nice night. Okay, I'll talk to you real soon.